<laughs> What's going on, YouTube? My name is Kiever Montoya, and welcome back to Mario Party 3 Story Mode Hard Mode. In the previous episode, we did Chilly Waters. It was a great episode. Really enjoyed it, and, you know, it went well for the first board. And, yeah, in this episode, we're going to continue... We're going to do the the second board. So, yeah, um, let's see what happens. That was a, an, an amazing victory, Mario. Allow me to give you the Wood Star Stone. I'm trying to do an alien's voice, but it's so hard to do. Okay. Wait, what? Wait a second. Oh, who's that? Wario! How can you forget Wario's tremendous wit? You can't claim the wit start stamp yet. Now I'm just gonna have a little chat. Oof! Fine, we'll shall decide this in the one one on one battle on Gate Guys Duel Map. Yes, let's go. Okay, so yeah. Uh, well, if you're ready, let's go to Gate Guy. Now we get to go to the du the dual board map, and that's how the story mode works. And by the way, um, you can ask the the Manalian star about the star levels. Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 And also, you can check the graph, the charts. Yes. So, um, in the last episode, I should have showed this off. Um, if you in battle royale, if you have at least two more stars than the second place finisher, you get the S rank. You should always get S rank because um, S rank's important, and you'll see why in the, at the end of the story mode. If you if you get an A rank, if you have one more, uh, B if you have the same number of stars as the second place finisher, you have by winning more coins, then you get a B rank, and C, which is very rare, which nobody can get. Um, have the same number of stars of uh, number of stars and coins as the second place finisher, win a, a roll of the die, of the die, which that never happens for me. And the dual maps, when you have to win and have three more hearts than your rival, A, two more hearts than your rival, and B. So I'm gonna focus on getting S ranks. If if I can get some A's, but not a lot, I can't get B or C. So yeah, I'll try not to get a B. But yeah. Anyway, let's go to Gate Guy. Let's go! Welcome, Mario! Duel round one is for the Wit Star Stamp. You'll play on this map in this round. Um, Gate Guy, a map with shortcuts. Let's be the challenger! No one is more cunning, cunning than me. Wario! Let's... Finally, let's go over the rules. In story mode, the number of, of turns is set to 20 turns. The handicap option is off. Let's battle it out fair and square. In this minigame setup, all minigames are selected. Yes. Let's start the duel! So yeah, in story mode, you have to go. You have to do a battle royale map and then duel map. That's how it goes in Mario Party 3. Welcome to the first duel board. Gate guy. I've been waiting for you. This is Gate Guy. First, you have to decide on the turn order. I'll spin around and we'll see which side comes up. If I turn if I turn up heads, Mario goes first. But if I turn up tails, then Mario goes first. So yeah, there's no dice block in this. You just gotta you just gotta look, let the Manalian star do heads or tails. It's like flipping a coin. Let the Manalian star spin begin. Oh, it's decided. Going first in the blue corner is Wario, so we have to switch places. And moving second in the red corner is Mario, so take. Na next, you must choose where your partners will walk. Come, partners, come here. So I got a Koopa, yeah, Mario has a Koopa and Wario has a bomb. You can either put him in front or behind. Uh, where you want your partner to walk, front or behind, make your, make your selection. Put him behind, because Koopa is a defense partner. Finally, I'll give you each 10 coins, use them wisely. Thank you! Let the games begin! I love the music here! Awesome! So yeah, in this gimmick of the board, you have to, um... If you pass the gate guy, you have to pay him 5 coins to, you know, cross. And in reverse space, you get to go backwards a lot. Okay, well, he has a chance to attack me. 
Fantastic. So yeah, that's pretty much the gimmick of this board. Gate guy, you just gotta pay five points to get across. And this guy's name is Belltop. If you get to zero for him, you have to play minigame. And the tumble spaces right here is also dual minigame as well. Dual minigame Belltop, dual minigame, um, um, uh, yeah, when you get to see tumble. Anyway, um, if you land on the hat, this, um, you'll get a power up for your partner. And you'll, you have to pay him more coins. And you have to pay, if you ran out, if you have no coins while you have to pay, you lose all your partners, so, yeah. Okay. Let's see. Uh, I land on happening space, so... Ah, yep, let's go up. Cross. See, I land on a, a power-up. I'm going to power up your partners. And that's how it works. And Warrior was a 9. Actually, if he gets me, I, I don't really care. Because, you know, he, he it's a bomb. I can show him in his attack. Alright, here's the first of battle. Attack! Boom! Yeah, if you- it, the bomb just explodes, but you lose him afterwards, so that's good. And Warble's a 9. I will have one, of course. Three. And I'm, 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 I'm about to lose my partner, too. I only have one coin left. Yep, if you, if you turn to start, you get to get ten coins. And your power-up will go down, so yeah. In front. Oh, sniff it, I'll take him. Snippet, Snippet is a good partner to have. See you again. But he's expensive, though. And Wario's a 7. And let's see what he gets. And he gets his partner back. So yeah, duels sometimes go fast, sometimes they take long. And he doesn't want to pay. Okay. Fine by me. Hey everyone, it's minigame time! Let's see what we get. Skill- Not skilly. Silly screws! We haven't played that one yet. So this one you have to line up the nuts up just right and race towards the goal. Counterclockwise, A, B, clockwise. The faster you spin the net, the more time it will take to stop. Sounds weird saying that. But let's be careful. There. Yep, we win. Finish! Awesome. Mind my chair. <laughs> and that's this is the mini game results screen, which I like. That's why this game is awesome with dual maps, of course. Okay, I will an 8. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yes, please! Oh! There we go! Revenge! Now this is a Sniffet's attack. He shoots like a big green, a bluish green ball. There's two attack. 
Hey everybody, it's minigame time again! Too many games in one turn, and it is... Bowser Toss! This one is another good one, for me. It, it's kinda hard, cause... Well, first, open the book. This one, you have to spin Bowser around and round, as, then throw him as far as possible. Press A to button mash the A button and adjust, about, adjust the angle. To really throw far, you, it's not just pressing the A button, the angle is important too. Yeah, don't mess up the angle because you won't go get anywhere. Well, let me focus. That was good, but I would have meant farther if I timed the angle right. But hey, I win! Awesome! Very, very awesome. Yes! Good. Oh, would it be great if we roll a 1 next turn? I can just kill him. You can have one heart left. Hey! Wait. That's okay, I I'm okay with that. We just gotta attack the move on. The partners can mess you. Sometimes the partners can, like, trick you if they're gonna get hit or not. So let's see if it will work. Okay, well, I roll a 9. Battle! Attack! Oh no, sometimes they just stand still. Sometimes they can dodge attacks. Okay. Uh. Alright, Sensei, you were good for now. I got Koopa Kid. I mean, I don't really want him. Because, well, he, 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 he's good, but sometimes he can be a pain. Okay, now he rolls a 9. Okay. Oh, you're gonna go backwards. You roll a 10. Oh, sweet. If I roll a high number, I can get him. Alright, another minigame. And there we go, we got all the dual minigames. Foul play. This one, you said to ch catch a freaking chicken. Which is annoying. Um, try to chase down the runaway chicken and get ahead of your rival by jumping the fence. Yep. It's easy to lose a chicken because it's so nibble and quick. If you can't find it, follow its footprints. So this one is annoying. I hate catching chickens at a farm. If I'm so lucky enough to do this. See? That's that's what it's annoying about it is. Dude, you you have very much chances to get that chicken. Ah! See? Gotcha! You just gotta like trick him and then make a spawn trap on him. Hooray! Nicely done. Me? Yes! Alright, now I, I think I, I kind of regret trading out Sniffit, but I just want to save up my coins. Because I don't want to lose them. Okay, I roll a 5. Sure. Alright, one more. Okay, 5 coins, I'll take. Okay, you rolled a 3. Why? Wow, you're not in a good situation, man. And also, you can check your partner's stats. Here's Koopas, his attack are very powerful, but he has decent stamina. His low pay is a, price, a plus, which is good. Check all the partners here. We'll read them after. Not really, right now. Okay. Alright, let's see. Here's Baby Bowser's attack. Oh, it worked! Oh! Yes! His attack, he just changes into Bowser. Sometimes he'll, he'll like, mess up he'll fail his attack, but you know, 
it works! I didn't expect that to happen! But yeah, sometimes you'll miss his attack and mess up, but yeah. Um, and also, the if your characters have power, power up, they'll do special effects, well, which we'll see one of them. But anyway, we did it! Hold it, game over! I did not expect him to change. Yeah, but yeah, that's why that's why I don't really like him because you know it's 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 like a 50-50 chance he will change. Okay, nice. Well, very well played. Let's view the results. First, let's look at the remaining heart pieces. I have four, War has zero. And now at last the results are in. It's time to announce the winner. We were falling for the sky! And Mario just fell to the abyss. The winner is Mario! Yahoo! Mario's the winner! Oh yeah, that is awesome. As you see, the Koopas are standing by Mario because it's his partner. Very awesome. Good. I definitely won that. Yep. I definitely won that. Very perfect. Like, I didn't expect this to go really well. Nice. Okay, and we get an S for that. Awesome. And with that, I'm gonna end the episode right here. Very short episode, I know. But, you know, I'm gonna be doing one Battle Royale map for like an hour, and then the dual map, whatever. But yeah, that's what I like to do, so... Yeah, other YouTubers like to do that, so, yeah. If you're on stream, you can do it as long as you want. But, yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe for more Mario Party 3 Story Mode, Hard Mode, if you're interested, and other fun stuff on the channel. And, yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, bye, guys.